came mm. out of the airport, mm. uh, came walk to the to the immigration, and then I, I handed over my passport, and then you know he called over the officer, then called over another person, and I asked what is the problem. He says, "Oh, our system is down," and then I just started laughing, and so then I picked up my phone that I was to call my lawyers that is happening, right? When I tried to do that is when they kind of bundled me up. No, you can't make a call, and then pushed me. Uh, to another area of the airport immigration immigration mm. and then held me there i kept asking them am i under arrest they said no when i made an attempt to leave they wrestled me and then plain clothes officers then they ushered me into a room where plain clothes officers then came in and then started butcher i mean started torturing me booting me here and they spitting on me saying that foolish every man and uh, oh really uh wow well, uh Something about you being an insect. It was a very uh, ethnically charged. What language were they speaking? They're speaking tree. Wow. You know, and 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 really more treating me in that room. They were kicking you. Oh, kick! You were kicking me, spitting, spitting on, on me. Wow. One used their their knee on my on my neck. It was just it was, it was just really really horrid. Were and then fight, after that, they took me out of that that, mm. at that place, sent me into a different part of the airport where this continued for nearly five hours. In wow. fact, I was arrested around 5 p.m. and was taken to a Sherman police station around 11 p.m. And this time, as I said, I had had conversations with my lawyers. So they had come to the airport. Some of them were at the airport police station and some of them were at the airport trying to see like whether I would be allowed out and what was going to happen. And for those hours, they had no information what was happening. Right? My family was there as well. And eventually, they ended up releasing a statement that I was missing. At the time, I had been taken to, to a Sherman police station. I was being held there. It wasn't even till like 4 a.m. before the police released a statement saying that I wasn't missing and that, in fact, they had arrested me and that I was being kept at Tema, which was also not true, you know. Um, yeah, so that's kind of... How did know. they take you to that Sherman police station? 